Hey guys, how's it going? The British Gamer HD, and welcome to the first session of Dead Island since the update video. Now, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, make sure to go check out the update video that we uploaded a while ago. I basically explained that now videos are going to be done in sessions. Maybe there's something in here. I basically um, edit it all in Vegas and split it into episodes instead of recording half hour, stop recording. Half hour, stop recording, blah blah blah. I just record for however long as I want and um, just stop and edit it, whatever. It gives me more freedom as well with the amount of time um, each episode can be. Um, so, um, yeah, pretty much. Uh, so, what are we rich? What are we, can we actually do anything? We've got a machete on us for some odd reason. I don't know. We haven't played Dead I haven't played Dead Island in a while. Uh, but looking on Sam's beat, uh, my save file for the um obviously the playthrough is this main plot progress 84 percent so i'm hoping we can get near the um near the end of the game today um and that's nice uh, we're gonna get rid of that oh we're gonna keep all of that and give that to um how much money have we got i'm grabbing that then deadly metal kabuto i'm gonna grab that because we've got enough money to do so um, we're gonna mod this up. We're gonna mod this up, right? Right. So yes. Um, we stick on this thing. Razor mod. Two and four. One and four. One and four. It's got to be the razor mod, isn't it? That is by far our best weapon. Okay, so I don't actually know what we have to do. We're quite close to a level up. Um, we've got speak to Moen. Go to the police station. Find Bill. Obviously, oh, so we've got two at the police station. We're just going to go talk to Moen. I don't know even. Is he by his, the boat? I'm guessing he's by his boat. So, um. There we go. <laughs> uh, so we're going to go I've been waiting for you. You saved my life for the second time, so I owe you one, yeah. Your friend wasn't lying. I do know the way to the prison. It's fucking dangerous, so I don't like to go. But if you want, before we go, though, we gotta stop it. Yes, yeah, so this is nearly the end of it. Basically, we literally go back to town and we pick up some stuff for the boat. Um, and it's, it doesn't take too long, to be honest. So we are nearing the prison now, which is actually the final chapter or final destination really of the game and uh, once you're there you can't really go back so uh, <laughs> you might as well go um, but the prison isn't just like you turn up you do whatever you leave you there is a couple of side missions and there's a couple of good things that you can get in the prison actually um, but obviously the prison's not gonna be empty for some reason the uh, yeah just wait and see. so we're here with the boat and shit so we need to talk tomorrow listen friends there are two things that need to be taken First thing is gas for the boat. The second thing is something special for Titus, so he lets us through. Otherwise, we can forget about ever getting inside. Uh, bring my package from the secret stash. Get fuel from the boat. I can do that. Okay then. You'll find the fuel at the gas station. But you can find a car while you're there. I keep the stash for Titus in the red container by the seaside hangars. I'm staying. All right. So. Basically says to go get the package first. We're just gonna do it in whatever order, um, because there is a car near the um, red hangers. No, she get me. Motherfuckers all over me. The entire time we are here. Ain't got any fucking bullets for that. You got any bullets for that? What about a shotgun? That'll do, cancel out. Strong. Oh, oh, oh. There's no way I've got to learn the fucking controls again. Fucking again. Let's hope my uh, mic, uh, my mic, uh, my controller doesn't wires out on me. So we're gonna grab the final. For the rage. We're gonna try and get through this as quickly as possible. I haven't got any bullets, so I ain't gonna bother trying. I've only got my 
shotgun. Uh, there's a car in here, so we can go grab the car from there if we need to. I think we're going to go grab the supplies now. I just don't want to get the fucking suicide. about two hits, make sure you loot as well. Oh no. Oh. So, the stash is in there. Quite obvious. Red container. Stamina, please. Hey, one thing, they're all hitting the fucking deck, guys. So even though it is a session and stuff, uh, at some point I will like need to like pop out and do some stuff. But I can like edit that in the um, uh, edit that in Vegas. So at some point I will just pause the game. Or something. You probably won't even see me pause the game. Probably won't even act like it happened. Uh, but obviously, okay, we a lot. Um, recording non-stop for two hours isn't really possible if that makes sense. Oh, you fucking sh... Really? <laughs> fucking door? <laughs> Phoenix mod. Owens package. Can't even unlock them. Phoenix mod. Yeah, four that <laughs> What's next? Is there... And now we get... Are we getting the fuel now? Yeah, two. Well, we need to find a car. Desperately. I'm dealing with you, Mark. I think there's actually a car at the um, gas station. much longer now. I just realised how long that lasted. That's going to help out in the prison so much. I'm dealing with these motherfuckers. Right, there is actually a car over here which is nice. Well, that 
real quick. Like, this is like a main story mission. This is meant to take you a good however long. But you know what you're doing, it's peace piece. I don't know if I'll, I don't think I'll do the police station missions because I really like they're two just side missions. I know they're both the police station, we could knock them out in about half an hour. But like We've been doing this series for like six months this, since the first episode came out and we're still like going on it and it's just got to the point where you, I, I just need to finish the game like we've got uh, things like 11 hours worth of game time so I didn't expect to take this long I thought it would just be quite an easy little run through of a first game to play and it turns into quite something a bit more drastic all right brothers we are all more my father used to work on boats so we just need to go to his workshop all right all right you can take the boat right into the workshop i'll show you where they are there we go that should be up to the resort so there's the town back to the resort this is horrible this next bit like even though it's a game like the thought of having to do something like what's about to happen would just be fucking horrible well, you won't you won't see it yet, but um, I think it's after we do like the mission or something. Or oh, there's there's something we need to do. I can't remember. Four yeah, four rods from the workshop, uh, which we have to do, which literally takes five minutes because we're already here. I didn't understand like and obviously with a zombie game and like needing to be hard all the way through to be a challenge but how can zombies go on from dying from two shots from a paddle to needing three shots from a metal kabuto with fucking razor sharp fucking blades in it to even do any sort of damage <laughs> Seriously, have to go for the top. There's a suicide as well. Wait, what? Oh, fucking other rods, really? Is that it? We have to take out everyone and then just go back to the boat. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Let's go, we're wasting time. Oh, 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 now this bit. There's something there's something else I need to do, alright? But I need to do it alone. So just just wait here.
love you, Dad. Let's get the fuck off this island. Okay. All right. Let's get the fuck off this island. Shoot right. Hey, can you hear me? I heard screams in the lab. Something bad's happening. You gotta drop what you're doing and find out what's going on. God damn it, go! Go! Fucking hell, what now? Loading laboratory. I knew this was coming. I was thinking we don't get to the prison straight away, do we? We've got to do something else. Just remembered what else we got to do. Thanks, voice. Oh, we got fucking run all the way there, though. But we can't just fast travel there now, I don't think. Hello, everyone, okay? Oh. Maybe not. Ah. I think I know what's happened. Oh, no, there's... Oh, there's there wasn't this many fucking people in here before. Oh yeah, there's extra zombies in there. And the ones that would have come in and killed everyone. I'll turn up then, eh, bitch? He took my blood once. Then again, and again. He was... But I ran away from my village to go to the city. To go to school, so I know a person can only lose so much blood. I locked myself in the cage to get away from him. And when he tried to open it, using that computer, he opened them all. Way, wanker. And those things jumped on him tore him apart. I screamed, but no one came. Whiskey's dead? How can that be? He almost had the bloody vaccine. Let's open this up. Then he knew how to make it. Wait. What if he did? Maybe he did make it. Do you hear me? Search the bloody lab. It's gotta be there somewhere. The vaccine. Find it. Otherwise, my Emily isn't gonna make it. What do you mean this thing? If you travel to the prison, you won't be able to go back. Make sure you're ready to leave the island before continue. Warning, you're about to leave the island. Once you travel to the prison, you won't be able to get back. Make sure you're ready before you continue. I wish. Yes, we're not going to do the police station shit. Thank God. Now take it and don't bloody lose it. I'm waiting for you on the prison island. Hurry. Boom. We go, people. I unlocked all the doors I could. Not very many, unfortunately. I don't have access to much of the security grid since it's on emergency power. We're running on res power, and I don't know how long... If we lose cont, look for me and block... And for the love of God, if you cut... The prisoners don't bloody trust them. I'm responsible for a lot of them being here. So if you bring them to me, they'll kill me, and then you. 